Hello and welcome back to my channel. So the other day while I was at the dollar store and I was buying stuff for my dollar store Halloween makeup video, I came across Halloween press-on nails. <laughs> and uh, so I am wearing some right now and this is the package that I bought today. And I just kind of wanted to tell you my experience with them. I'm sure the dollar store has other kinds of press-on nails, but these are the actual like Dollarama brand press-on nails. They were a dollar fifty. First things first, what freaked me out about these is that you only get 12 in a package, which means I only had two nails in there that I could mess up. And not only that, but like the thumbnail paint on this one is all messed up anyway, so I was kind of bummed, you know? But I digress. So like literally all you do is you take these out of the tray and you push them onto your nails and that's just how they stick. And somehow they're like still stuck on. I stuck these on last night. It's been like literally 24 hours since I put them on and I still have all 10 fingernails. After I shot the footage that you're seeing now, uh, I felt like they were too long. Like I felt like I couldn't function. Now that's probably just me because I'm not used to long nails or maybe you know, I find that experience as well. So I did cut them, but like literally I just took a pair of scissors and snipped off the ends and then nail filed them a little bit so they weren't sharp. Like that was it. Um, it does say Happy Halloween at the top of the nails, so I really wanted to make sure I didn't cut that off, and so that's why my thumbnails are kind of long still, but I literally chopped them off and that's it. And the coolest part to me is it says to remove it, you just soak your nails in warm water. It, like, especially says do not use force, so, like, I'll just fill a bowl with hot water and stick my nails in and these will come off. And what kills me is, like, I can't believe they actually stayed on, like, I, I hadn't been gentle with them. I brushed my hair today, I did my makeup, you know, done everything that I would usually do. I've washed my hands multiple times, gone to the bathroom, that was one of my biggest fears, but I was worried I would like go to like wipe and then like lose a nail in the toilet. <laughs> but that didn't happen, obviously. So then they had two other kinds other than these sort of skulls and Happy Halloweens. They had these other skulls and ghosts that say boo. And they had like another set that was, I could, I could hardly see it because it was so high up, but it was just orange. So when I finally got them down, I could see that they had like really tacky looking like Halloween things on each nail. It's like one was a spider and one was like, and they were terribly painted on. I thought they were pumpkins from far away, so that's why I wanted them, but I didn't buy those because they were hideous. But these skeleton ones are cute and these skeleton ones are cute. So if you have a Halloween party or you just want to be festive or something, actually surprisingly and feel stupid recommending, but really recommend these, especially if you already have nail glue and you can just like reinforce some of the longer nails. I would definitely cut them. That might just be me personally because I felt like they were really long and I'm not used to having nails that long, but I really like them. <laughs> Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video, as weird as it is. I guess this one wasn't really super Halloween themed, but because the nails are Halloween, it felt like Halloween, you know? Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!